More cuts are on the way for the Lakota School District, but where those cuts will come from is still up for debate. Nine News reporter Bryce Onslinger is live at the Lakota District office where the school board held a special meeting tonight to map out a plan for deciding just where those cuts need to be made. Bryce? Well, Carol, the school board voted unanimously tonight to stop deficit spending and to cut $9 million from next year's budget. The hard part now is deciding where those cuts will come from. Britt and Bonnie Scarce have two children in the Lakota School District. Like many people in the area, they moved to Liberty Township because of the quality reputation of Lakota schools. But recent cuts and the thought of more has them concerned about the future of the district. I don't know that everybody thinks all this through. They just think no new taxes, and they don't think about the consequences of what it's going to do to your community uh, by not having a good, strong school system. Recent levy failures have forced board members to decide how to balance the budget without the benefit of increased revenue. It will be painful because there will be some program changes, some people that might be affected, and um, we'll look at that, and we'll be presenting those proposals within the next month. Superintendent Karen Mantia says the district has to do its best to balance the budget by making cuts while not impacting the quality of education received by students. The bottom line is we've got to reduce the deficit. It's $9 million uh, projected for next year. And tonight, the board made a really critical decision to say, yes, we need to uh, balance our budget. We need to uh, eliminate the deficit spending. And so our charge will be to look for as many efficiencies and then try to find those efficiencies that reach $9 million. I think the school board's doing their part now, and I think now I, I really hope that the community starts to consider passing. If they put another levy up, that they consider passing it, because at this point, we could be at risk of, you know, of, of kind of having the situation that Little Miami had. And, uh, you know, really, that's going to that's gonna hurt all homeowners a lot more than maybe your taxes going up by a few hundred bucks. Now, the next budget meeting will be held here at the district office February 13th. Parents and students should not expect any final decisions on budget cuts or where those cuts will come from until March. Carol? Bryce Onslinger live in Liberty Township. Thanks, Bryce.